Hello guys and welcome to a new tutorial and in this tutorial we will be um, making, well we actually won't be making anything, I'll be just teaching you the basic movements in Blender. This is just so people don't get confused with stuff um, and I can just post a link in the description of my Blender videos so they don't ask questions in the comments just this is just for the near future so to do some of these basic stuff okay so you open up blender and you have these default objects you have the cube here the lamp here and the camera here to delete stuff ensure that it is selected with this orange outline around its edges right click on the object you'd like to delete like that and then press X and then you want to click delete you can also hold shift right click and click on two objects and you see they're both selected then press X to delete let me just add in some more objects okay um yeah so also to move the objects, use these nodes and pull them across like that. To rotate your view, use the middle mouse button and if you don't have that and you're using your trackpad, press in between the left and the right button to move, so like I am using. I'm not using a mouse currently. Like so. And I can rotate my view behind, like here. To rotate an object, press R on the keyboard with that object selected, and this little arrow, dual arrow, will come up. And you can just rotate it like that. To restrict it to specific axes, axes, yeah. <laughs> you can go R, X to restrict it only to rotate on the X axis and R, Z to only restrict it on the Z axis and R, Y to restrict it only on the Y, etc. You can also scale this by pressing S. Also you can res scale using restricted axes. So if I want to scale only the Y axis I press S, Y. I'm sure you're getting the point by now. We can also, um, is that all with sizing objects moving around? I think so. This is just like the really basic stuff. Um, yes. Um, to I really don't know how to duplicate objects currently, so I just go Control C, Control V on this cube. Make sure it's selected when you're doing it, and we have another cube exactly the same. But you see, it's got a darker orange outline. Just right-click on the cube again to act, um, to make it a regular outline, like that. Um. There, this is just going to be a very short video, don't expect anything more than this. Um, thanks for watching, and next week I have a very exciting tutorial for you guys, and I'll catch you next time.